By default, the grid view allows end users to reorder columns by simply dragging their headers. The same drag and drop functionality is available to you in the Visual Studio Designer. You can also specify a column's position via its visible index property. Header drag and drop is enabled for all columns by default. To disable it for a particular column, use the Allow Move option. Note that this column's position can change as a result of moving other columns. If you want to completely disable column reorder within the view, use the view's Allow Column Moving option available under Options Customization. If you need to respond to column order changes at runtime, handle the view's column position changed event. In the handler, identify the column that was moved using the sender parameter. Then display the caption of that column and the category's column index. Run the application and move one of the columns. Notice the category column's position displayed in the status bar. Now move a column over category. You'll now see how one column reordering operation can actually affect other columns.